On Roblox, you've seen plenty of tiny hats. Like this. And plenty of massive hats. Like this. Ew, it smells. The hats I want to show you today glow, such as this one here. Ew, the sparkles. You didn't even mention that. That's cool. This fella here is called the Egg of Destiny, and it looks like crap. And that's intentional. As you can tell by the description here, Roblox uploaded this as an April Fool's Day egg, and it was only awarded to anyone who got the Egg of Destiny badge from this user here named Games, who is an official Roblox admin. A long time ago, back when Roblox did egg hunts, Games uploaded a testing server where players were able to get that badge. In addition to this hat having sparkles, it was also the first accessory to feature lighting. You can't really tell here, but let me show you a better example. It is in fact glowing with a perfect purple or pink light. The next shimmering star we have to talk about is the Sparkle Time Classic Pumpkin, which is quite a mouthful. And also the second hat ever to feature lighting. On top of the orange glow that this hat comes with, it also emits a bunch of cute, but also somewhat disturbing looking ghost creatures out of its head. Why? I don't know. Here's a solid image of the head glowing in game. Wow. Next up, we have the glowing reindeer nose. Now, this only glows when you're in game near a bright light, which is actually pretty cool. This item uses assets inside of Roblox games and texture in order to create an interesting effect. As you can tell, there is no glow coming from my nose, but once I step into the light, the nose instantly lights up and appears to actually be bright red, as if a glowing red nose would be. Wow. That's cloudy. Next up, we have the glowing green avatar. Uh, yeah, it does look cursed. I I'm pretty sure it is cursed. <laughs> Let's try it in game and see if it actually glows. While standing in the shade, there is absolutely no glow coming from this monstrosity. But as soon as we step into the light, it does begin to light up bright as if it were a firework on your body, which is very hazardous. Don't put fireworks on your body. It may have for you. Bad things will happen. They make these glowing bodysuits in green, red and blue. In case you want to look like a bunch of crumpled colorful tinfoil. Wow. Next one is something my boy Tempers would probably love because it's pizza themed. This one is advertised as a glowing item, but it only glows near light sources like the other ones I've been showing you. Not only is the neon pizza sign not glowing yet, but it's also going into my head and piercing my brain. So I don't know if I'm gonna make it through this video, guys. Let's see if it glows. <laughs> Um, kind of? I don't, I don't know. This one's a little, eh, uh, it's a bit of a stretch. And I don't just mean that cheese. Hey, hey. <laughs> Let's check a more lighted up area. If you are literally right next to one, it kind of does. You pass this time pizza sign. Next up is a really cool one. This is the glowing floating sword array. From the same maker as the pizza sign, let's see if this one is a bit more accurate to the description. <laughs> a cool back accessory, but not a single bit of glow without light. However, stepping into the light does make it seem like they glow at least a bit. So if you really are next to a bright light source, they will start to glow. I mean, but you have to be like touching it. They glow. Next is the glowing lightning eye spark. Something that sounds terrible terribly painful and I think is supposed to make you look like Sans Undertale Man? Count me in. Here it is in game. So far it looks like a nasty eye infection or, or a tear that streamed out of my eyeball while I was driving with the car windows down. Why you always say something? But as soon as you step into light, we have the most impressive results so far. This thing really is glowing. And putting it directly under light proves that even more. This thing really does light up just like Snoop Dogg. <coughs> the next item is called a flaming mohawk, and as you can tell, it is awesome. You look just like Johnny Test if they were sporting a mohawk. But Kaden, that's not glowing. Shut up! It is glowing, you see? And it's on fire. <gasps> I'm on fire! And so is the next hat that I'm about to show you. The final hat. Hiccup's Helmet. A free accessory that was once obtainable from a How to Train Your Dragon sponsorship on Roblox. It sets your head on fire, gives you a little bit of a glow, and looks cute. If you want a hat like this, worry not. The Flaming Mohawk is still on sale. Well, now that you know about all these glowing hats, go steal mommy's credit card and go on a spending spree. Have fun!